This is Linlithgow in Scotland, not far from Edinburgh. It was here in 1570 that James Moray, Regent Moray, was assassinated by James Hamilton of Bothwell Hall and Woodhouse Lee. James Hamilton hid in a house belonging to his uncle, who was the Archbishop of St Andrews, James Hamilton. He put a black sheet behind him to hide his shadow, and he had some washing hung up, and he blocked the various entrances with gorse. He knew that the regent would be going past on his horseback, and he shot him with uh, his rifled gun. Probably the first time that somebody was ever assassinated with a rifle. Regent for James the Sixth and First was the half brother of Mary Queen of Scots, who had abdicated shortly before. Now he died several hours after being shot. James Hamilton is said to have escaped his pursuers by stabbing his horse with his knife, and this forced it to jump a wide ravine. He then made it back to Hamilton, where he was given protection. Eventually, he fled to France. In later years, being thought of as an assassin, he was asked to kill somebody else, but said that he was only interested in settling his own debts. The Hamiltons were great supporters of Mary, Queen of Scots. In fact, James had fought at the Battle of Langside and lost, Regent Moray being the leader on the other side at the time. It said he had a particular grudge, because in revenge for fighting at Langside, the regent had gone to his house at Bothwell Hall. It was known that James had a number of assistants in this assassination. His uncle, the Archbishop of St Andrews, was eventually hung for his involvement. The gun itself was kept for many years by the Dukes of Hamilton. <laughs> 